Are you there? Are you awake? You know it's happening. Every year counts, and every ton of carbon also counts. This is all going Another to change. Another result of climate change that is pretty devastating. Greenhouse gases are really already changing. Outside. Nature is sending urgent signals. Just take a look. Human activity is responsible for the preponderance of the reality of global warming. Climate change is ultimately it's a choice. Choice. Wake up. Wake up. Are we awake or are we still sleepwalking? Realization starts with learning. We probably learn something new every day. We learn throughout our lives, through the formal education system, in our professions, and through our private lives. At the United Nations, we think about the types of knowledge, skills, and behaviors that the world is going to need in order to be able to live with climate change. Not just the risks, the downside, but also the opportunities because there are opportunities. Climate change offers a way for countries to come together, to cooperate, to understand each other, as we saw in the lead up to the climate change meetings in Paris, where there was such a strong sense of goodwill and moving forward. Je vois que la réaction est positive, je n'entends pas d'objection. L'accord de Paris pour le climat est accepté. Article 6 of the UN Framework Convention on Climate Change recognizes the importance of education, training and public awareness. So these elements are seen as part of the solution, starting points even. But what do we actually do with the fine words? How do we make a difference through education, training and public awareness? At the global level, it's really about improving the quality of the debate by providing foundational learning for as many people as possible. What's causing climate change? who are the most affected, because this is the way that we will find the creative solutions needed to solve complex problems. At the country level, and here I'm talking about some of the most climate vulnerable countries, a little bit more help is needed, a bit more structure and organization, working through the formal education system, with professional training institutions, and increasingly with the private sector. UN Climate Change Learn is a growing partnership of countries and international organizations helping to bring solutions through climate change literacy. We work with all age groups, but we think that it makes sense to start with the youth. The reality is that they have the most to lose from climate change, but also the most to hope for. They're our future policymakers, and for now, they're the message carriers. <laughs>